so cute. Hey guys, and today I'm going to be doing a Kiko and Zoeva unboxing. These are just a few things that I've picked up during the sales and before Christmas. So these first things I actually picked up before Christmas. This was in fact around about November I think I picked these up. I went to Nottingham and they had a Kiko store and I was like, what? They come in these cute little bags that say Kiko Milan Milano on them. They're a German brand and they are pretty good for value. They're like kind of top end brands like MAC and um, NARS and Urban Decay and Too Faced. The quality of the products match their prices kind of thing but they're not that expensive at all. First things I wanted to pick up were some more eyeshadow sticks and I haven't just got two more. I went and bought myself four more. I am absolutely addicted to these things. They are amazing. They last incredibly long and I can't, I've never tried any other eyeshadow stick that is as good as these. I've, I've had, I've worn my two others for a while and they are just I can't, I've never, yeah, I don't have words, they're just so good. So these are £6.90 each. Four of these would amount to one of By Terry's eyeshadow sticks. I'll put the names and the links in the description box below. So this one is number five. They come in this gorgeous black packaging which says Kiko on it. They feel very similar to NARS. So that is the colour of that one. It's a nice brown. It's just beautiful. This one is number six. This one is a kind of lighter brown. We've got an eyelash. Ugh. There you go, it's a nice bronzy, light brown colour. It's definitely one I'm gonna be using. Then I have number 21. Oh, like, ugh, this one's my favourite. The, the colour on this, I was like, no way. <laughs> it's a pink with a gold shimmer running through it, so it's kind of like, it creates that rosy gold um, eyeshadow look. And it is, I tried this on in the um, store and it would just look stunning. Such a spring kind of look and we're going into spring now so I just thought yeah, why not. Oh, just gorgeous, stunning. I totally recommend these sticks by the way. If you think, um, if you're anything like me and don't want to spend like £28 on a By Terry eyeshadow stick, totally pick these up. Oh, my nose! So runny. This one is number 36 and I think this one's a purple which I I don't really often wear purples so that's why I picked this one up because I thought it was really nice and I want to try it. So this is again pretty much like the pink but it's a purple with gold shimmer also running through it. It's not solid purple, it's kind of a, a berry um, plum colour so that is the colour the shade with the gold shimmer running through it. Next I have is a package. This is where the unboxing begins. I have actually already opened this but just to check that everything was in here but I haven't actually looked at the actual products so this is exciting. <laughs> okay. Oh that's so nice of them. They've actually kind of sent a bag <laughs> with the box. I've Got a Kiko bag, another one. A list, a list of what's in this box. Oh, and it's nicely bubble wrapped. So I got a few things from different ranges because of oh, some of the limited edition stuff. First thing I'm gonna show you is what I bought from the Christmas range. This is the Kiko Perfect Star Gel Duo Nail Lacquer and Top Coat Set. So you get two nail polishes. One is the top coat and one is the actual shade beautiful packaging. I love this kind of like dotty um, star design. Inside we have, there's a little booklet and um, here is the perfect star gel top coat. This packaging guys is stunning. Like you wouldn't think that was a nail polish. You'd think it was like a little spray or something. Well I would. This, oh I just love this colour. So I, as you guys know I love burgundy and berry reds. This one is more of a darker purple with gold and burgundy glitter in it, which was right up my street, I thought. They had different, they had a red shade, a pink shade, and then they had this shade. I'm not sure if they had a gold one. So 
that's that one guys so my favorite range out of the kiko um, brand would have to be the rebel romantic range there were so many things i wanted from this range that i just couldn't get because most of the things were out of stock by the time i made this order but one of the things i really did want because i wanted something to just pop in my bag i don't have one anymore so i have this gorgeous kiko rebel romantic rose gold mirror as soon as i saw it i was kind of like shall i i did it um, this packaging, I did not expect it to come in this gorgeous packaging. It's stunning. Like the lettering's rose gold. Seriously, guys. Oh my days. Comes in this gorgeous rose gold pouch. How stunning is this? It's incredibly stunning. Rose gold pouch. And then inside the pouch, we have this gorgeous rose gold mirror. But that's the mirror. So you have the classic zoom in one on the bottom and then the, the normal one on the top. The next thing I bought from the Rebel Romantic range and the very last Kiko thing I actually bought, two lavishing, are they lav intensely lavish lipsticks. These two looked very similar but very different at the same time, shade number four and number five and Kiko totally upped their game with this, these Rebel Romantic range because they have never done lipstick packaging like these, Ugh, they're, they're just rose gold packaging lipstick oh. and it totally gets better, it gets better because remember my Zoeva lipsticks, they're magnetic these are magnetic also and when I found this out I was like that's it, that's it, Kiko won me over, completely won me over so number four, this is kind of like a, um, it's a very, very neutral red. It's a deep neutral rather than a um, over, over the top neutral. Um, but yes, this is the shade. And if I twist it up, that would be a good idea. It has like Shelly imprint on it. The signature logo for this range. Number five, this is kind of going more into the pinks and um, very deeper tones. So this is kind of like middle shade throughout the whole range. Got more purple in it um, and definitely has kind of like a bit of bright pink. Cannot wait to use those babies. I now have three Zoeva packages. So this one, this had just come out when I bought this. So, and when it came out, I was like, literally, I have to have that. It looks amazing. It's the taupe zoeva eyeshadow palette yeah this gorgeous packaging there love zoeva's packaging for the eyeshadow palettes i just love how they're so compact and slim as well like they're so easy to just pop in your bag so with the coco blend um palette they are kind of like more deeper dark tones these this taupe one has all the um kind of uh, neutral sh metal um shimmers it's the perfect palette to create the taupe look and taupe is very I think is very good for kind of autumn as well as spring why not use them in the summer I use eyeshadow all year round just do what you want with them go crazy go, get creative that's what I say just get creative get crazy get creative that's my motto just try and show you all of that absolutely stunning this shade is oh, amazing I think that's my favorite second box I haven't opened this one yet here we go guys I can't remember what I bought in this one. What did I get? Oh, no! I don't know what I got there. So in here, what did I buy? Oh yes, I remember now. So the first thing I got, the Lux face paint brush and the, all the individual brushes come in these little pouches. They all come in this packaging. And this is to keep the brush safer. I think that also it's a good idea um, when you're washing your brushes and you want them to dry because you can just keep them flat and straight with this on it. So I think it's, I recommend keeping these. It's pretty, it's very good for your brushes. So definitely keep those. This is the 109 Lux Face Paint Brush. And this I, I'm hopefully going to be using for is contour. So I think that's going to go perfect on my cheekbones. Also in this package, I got myself another one of these Lux Cream lipsticks. You know, I have one wish that I got around Halloween time. This one is called Cross My Heart, and this is the deepest shade they have. 
I love Zoeva's packaging. It's magnetic. Oh, that has such a better click than the Kika one. Maybe I didn't do the Kika one right enough. Again, it comes with Colour Love Makeup on the side, just there. And there's the shade, a nice, very dark, dark, deep red. This is like my signature shade. I love dark reds and they just, I just think they really, really suit me. Next one, the biggest one. Let's take a look in here. Working box. More packaging. That's more packaging. Because I spent over a certain amount of money, you get you get to choose a free item. And there was a mascara, a lipstick, and a beauty blender. And I've never tried beauty blenders, so I thought I'd try this one. And it's a cheap, nice and cheap one. I think it was around about normally three pound, four pound, maybe five. You get it for free, so it's a free item because you spend over a certain amount of money and I thought, why not? I'm going to want to try one eventually, so why not try a cheap one and it's free now, so. Next I have in here is the Rose Golden Eyeshadow Palette. I really love the design on this. A beautiful swirly design and they all individually reflect the light. They don't all reflect the light at the same time, which is what I just really like about this. Then you have a key, and right at the end of the key, this is attention to detail right here. The end of the key is shaped in the letters RG, so rose gold. I'm not sure if you can see that, you might be able to, but it's an RG, and just wow. So in this palette, we have, how many do we have? We have one, two, three, we have three matte shades, and I'm quite frankly scared of this one. <laughs> it's black and scary <laughs> um, but the rest of the colours are absolutely stunning but absolutely love this palette I I don't know which one my favourite one is oh that nearly dropped that is not good and there's one more thing I have to show you and oh I'm so excited to use this this is the Zoeva rose gold brushes I've always wanted a set of brushes and I really didn't know kind of what set I wanted to go for. It comes in this gorgeous travelling pouch, so it's perfect for when you are going abroad, when you go on a holiday, when you're going to a friend's house. And inside we have all the brushes. Oh, oh guys, so excited, so, so excited. It comes with eight brushes, pretty much all you need, I think, you get in here. So the first one, here. This is the 102 Silk Finish Brush and guys, I think I just fell in love. Beautiful, it's just stunning, can't get over it, over it, I am singing to myself. And this is again super super soft and it's called the Powder Brush and the 106. There we go. This is the 127 Lux Sheer Cheek Brush and this is going to be mainly for um, my blusher. The next brush, the 110 Face Shape Brush. I forgot to mention they all say Colour Love Makeup on them still, so it's so cool. This is the Concealer Buffer and it's the 142 brush. This one is the Lux Soft Definer Brush for your eyes. Just gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. This is the Wing Liner 317 brush. So this is the 231 Lux Petite Crease and I am so excited to use this. That is the end of my unboxing. And I'm gonna get to use all of these products. I cannot, I'm just so excited, cannot wait. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, please subscribe to our channel and comment below. I will see you guys next time and well, yeah, have a nice day, bye. Bye. Bye, okay. Completely done.